Alerts for new followers, subscribers and gifters can now be added to Live Studio. This has been massively improved since Live Studio was launched, so let's add them to Live Studio now. So on the left of Live Studio, click on Add Source and then click on Alert. Now simply click on these three tabs here and activate the alerts that you want. I know for many of you, that's probably all you clicked on the video for, so hit subscribe if you found this useful. However, keep watching and I'll share some tips and tricks for this, and I'll also compare it with the alternatives. So we'll start by customizing the alerts, and let's click back onto the general tab for that. If you're getting annoying rigging noises while you're setting up the alerts, just click on this speaker icon in the bottom right, it keeps previewing the sound. So firstly, if I click on preview, you can see there's two different layouts, here's layout 1, and here's layout 2. Layout 2 is my personal favorite. Next up, the alert parries here decides whether the alerts go into a queue. If you want to give everyone a chance to see their name on the screen, then leave this unchecked. However, if you have a really active live stream, this could mean that the alerts get backed up by many minutes. So I would check the alert parries box if your stream is really active. The alert duration is self-explanatory. I think the five second default is fine. For the background color here, I'm gonna suggest you change this percentage to zero. If I click on the preview here, quickly click on the background color, you can see the change. It basically makes it transparent. The background color is not needed. It would simply cover things that are behind the alerts. The alert preview is self-explanatory. It just changes this preview box here. And for the opacity here, you can see if I turn this down, it just looks really weird. So I would leave the opacity on the maximum setting. So now let's quickly look at how you can customize the other three tabs here. We'll start with the follower tab. Obviously check this box if you want follow alerts. For the custom text here, I'm gonna suggest you change this. So personally, I'm gonna change it to name is now following with a full stop. Unlike TikTok, I like my grammar and that's obviously called a period if you're American. So you can actually replace this icon which appears next to the text. Personally, I think it's fine. You could also remove it by just uploading a 200 by 300 completely transparent background. Next up, you can choose from one of TikTok's three different alert sounds, or you can just completely turn off the alert sound. Personally, I like to turn off the sound on follower alerts, which makes the sub alerts and the gift alerts feel a bit more special. For the trigger, I strongly suggest you leave this on one. Let's just look at what happens if I turn it to three, for example. It just says username and two other viewers started following. So if three people follow, two of the names are not gonna show on the screen. So I'll just set that back to one now. And the final two you can see here is it just changes the color of the text. I'm gonna leave mine on the defaults. Let's move to the subscriptions tab. And all I'm gonna really suggest you do here is you're gonna change the text here again. I'm just gonna remove the reference to you because it doesn't really make sense. And again, I'm gonna add a full stop or a period as the Americans call it. And on this particular one, again, I'm leaving the sound on to make it feel a bit more special than the follow alert. Finally, let's move on to the gift tab and this isn't as customizable as you might want it. So we'll look at some alternatives later, but we'll see what it can do now. As you probably saw from the old preview, it just shows the number of coins. It doesn't show a gift icon and it can't really be customized for different gifts. So once again, for me, all I'm really going to do, I'm going to change the text. I don't know why coins is capitalized, so I'm going to remove the capital C. And again, I'm picky with my grammar, so I'm putting a full stop. Finally, if we scroll down, you can decide how many coins trigger the alert. If you want every gift to be triggered, then set it to one. But if you find yourself getting too many low value gifts, just up the number. Now we'll look at some alternative to Live Studios alerts. But just quickly, if you're looking for any personal help about anything to do with TikTok Live, check out my Fiverr page. It's in the description and I'll be happy to help. So is that the best option for TikTok Live alerts? Well, let's compare it with Tickfinity. I have a link to Tickfinity in the description as well as a link to my full Tickfinity tutorial. So we'll very briefly look at it here. Tickfinity is fully functional with Live Studio and like Live Studio's alerts, it can offer follower, subscriber and gift alerts. I personally use Tickfinity because it has way more customization options. For example, here is my subscriber alert on Tickfinity. I'm showing an animation, I'm playing an audio file, I'm putting text on the screen, and I'm using text to speech as well. There's also options to show pictures and play videos, which I didn't choose for this one. And if I scroll down a bit, there's even more customization options here. The other great thing about Tickfinity is you can set custom alerts for different gifts. So for example, you can see I've got one alert for a TikTok gift, 
a different alert for a corgi gift, different alert for perfume. I've used Tickfinity to set so many different custom gift alerts. Unfortunately, with Live Studio, a Rose and a TikTok universe would be treated the same. So which of these two options should you use? Well, I think it depends how much you want to customize your live stream. If you're just looking for simple alerts and you want to get set up really quickly, then just go with live studio alerts. However, if you've got 10, 20 minutes spare, then I highly recommend Tickfinity. Your viewers are going to have way more fun using Tickfinity's highly customizable alerts than they'll have with the boring live studio alerts. Thanks to the channel members for helping fund these videos, including Angel, our gold tier channel member. Subscribe if you found this helpful, and thanks for watching.